all right guys so in today's video we are going to be installing and styling this beautiful gorgeous curly wig okay get into it very much dramatic edges and today i wanted to do like you know two little pigtails in the front i think this hairstyle was so freaking cute so if you're interested in seeing how we installed and styled this video definitely keep on watching so today's video is in collaboration with asteria hair this is their box and these are the goodies that came with it edge brush um elastic band wig caps eyelashes everything so this wig does come pre-plucked look at this wig guys oh my god like a lot of wigs say pre-plucked but this is truly pre-plucked -pre so do not make the same mistake as me okay i made a mistake and i said oh let me pluck some more guys i over plucked my wig i did you know even the greats make mistakes okay but it's okay i had installed the wig and i just feel like it wasn't given because i pre i plucked it too much and then i also was lazy with my cap if you guys saw in that clip my cap was showing so you know i had to bring it back i had to show you guys that asteria hair do not play you do not have to pluck this wig and you do have to do a ball cap method because their lace is just so beautifully thin that it's gonna show that ball cap if it's not put down properly so it's okay so right here, I'm going in with my traditional bod cap method. I do it in all my videos. I put down my glue on the perimeter of my hair. Then I also spray it down with my even lace spray for a little bit extra security. And now we're just gonna cut off the excess cap that is on my head. Now, today's cap wasn't giving. It wasn't giving. I'll tell you guys that right now. I don't know what was going on, okay? The 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 hair fairies wasn't with me today um, with, the, with the flawless install, but it's okay because Asteria hair came and saved the day and it just ended up still coming out cute so after i put a little bit of my cream foundation from ruby kiss shade 09 all over the cap now i cleaned off my forehead with 91 percent alcohol this is going to remove all the makeup and the natural oils from my um skin so the glue can actually adhere to the lace well um and now i'm going to go ahead and take my ghost bond glue put a layer on my head smooth it down and then we're going to blow dry it on the hot setting okay so sometimes i do cool but today i'm on hot okay um i did go ahead and do two layers of glue this time i didn't want the wig to be down for too long but also you know I want to, you know, some type of hold down. So the wig is pre-cut because like I said, I did install it already and I had to go back and reinstall it to give you guys what it deserves, okay? So after I glued her down, my cousin had to come in. My cousin saved the day for me in this whole entire video. She had to grab that blow dryer so fast to um to like get it to glue down and like seal on my head because I didn't want it to slide back, okay? So we're just, you know blow drying this is what we're looking like yeah yeah get into it okay now i'm gonna take my lace band and i'm just going to tie this on my head also i'm very excited for this video because i always do brand new installs so this is kind of what it looks like when you do a reinstall so i did go ahead and pull out my edges off camera because i show you guys how i do my edges 120 000 times okay but if you guys want a updated video on how i do it i got you okay but today i just pulled them out i'm still gonna show you how i do it but yeah so after cutting my, my edges at an angle, I'm gonna go ahead and take my half an inch hot comb, hot comb, I meant flat iron, I'm gonna take my, my half an inch flat iron and I'm going to curl my edges. I like to curl towards me, so under is how I like to curl my edges. Um, it just comes out easier for me. I feel like when you curl under, it's just, form so much easier than when you curl up, but that's just a personal preference. So yeah, I'm just curling my edges. Now I'm gonna take my mousse. Now this mousse in the gray can is my favorite mousse to get because it does not contain any alcohol. So whatever mousse that you get, um, make sure it doesn't have alcohol in it because if it has alcohol all in it, you will see that it will lift your lace. Your lace will start lifting. But if it doesn't have alcohol like this brand, it won't do that so after molding my hair down with the mousse then i go in with some extra reinforcement my even lace spray and then i'm gonna go ahead and just you know make sure i get my edges nice and swoop the dooped and laying how i wanted to lay my girl okay and we're gonna do that all over the head today's edges were very very you know extra because i wanted this look to be just fun and just you know very creative so that's what i did so we're gonna go back in now and i'm going to part a section of the hair that i want to put into the pigtails i kind of wanted the part to be kind of like at a curve if you guys can see then i'm going to take my spritz and i'm going to go ahead and just hot comb the hair now be careful with that spritz because when you spray in hot comb girl the steam literally runs to your scalp but it's okay because we're getting a bomb install and that's on period okay so i'm just hot combing this hair making sure it's nice and flat 
Um, like I said, what can I do with my, my, without my cousin? Shout out to my cousin, Celine. I love you so much, girl. I could not do this by myself. If you guys can see, I have gummy bears on my nails. So the gummy bears were like getting caught inside of the elastic band and it just wasn't working. So my beautiful cousin came and helped me today. Thank God she's at my shop because the girl, I needed the help. So like I said, we're going to go ahead and do the side part at a curvature. Um, and I'm going to spray some spritz on there. Um, all sections of the hair is going to get some spritz and then I'm going to take my hot comb and just make sure that this is nice and flat before it goes into its ponytail. Right, guys so this is what the wig is looking like my cousin was literally in love with this hairstyle she says i look like a baby which i think i do this hairstyle made me look like five years younger but um yes i'm just taking that hot comb in the back and just smoothing everything down making sure the the ponytails are very very flat because you know that's just how it's going to look more sleek and just more you know salon finish so this is what the unit is looking like after i put a little bit of water on the curls no conditioner no nothing extra just water this hair is so bomb the curl pattern crazy the plucking that was on this wig before i decided to go best with anything was so bomb guys this is the first way that i can say that you can actually take out of the box and not have to pluck or bleach i did not bleach the notch or, or not or anything i literally just put it on my head this is what the hair looks like after styling it and just throwing a little bit of water on it guys this hair is so bomb asteria hair i love you guys so much your hair is top notch okay so if you're interested in purchasing this unit all the information will be down below in my description box with purchasing links and promo codes yes guys love this hair it's definitely team stacy approved um yeah that's pretty much it for today's video if you haven't already subscribe to the channel join the team and just do it like nike give this video a big thumbs up and i cannot wait to see you guys in my next video love you guys bye